The end of linear chromosome pose unique problems during DNA replication because DNA polymerase can only elongate from a free 3' hydroxyl group. The replication machinery built the legend strand by a bad stitching mechanism. RNA primer provides 3' hydroxyl group at regular interval along the legend strand template, whereas the leading strand elongate continuously in the 5' to 3' direction all the way to the end of the template. The legend strand stops short of the end. Even if a final RNA primer will build at the very end of the chromosome, the legend strand still will not be complete. The final primer will provide a 3' hydroxyl group to synthesize DNA, but the primer will later need to be removed. The 3' hydroxyl group on adjacent DNA fragment provides starting places for replacing the RNA with DNA. However, at the end of the chromosome, there is no 3' hydroxyl group available to prime DNA synthesis. Because of this inability to replicate the end chromosome will progressively shorten during each replication cycle. This end replication problem is solved by the enzyme tolymerase. The end of chromosome contains a G-rich series of repeat called a telomere. Telomerase recognizes the tip of an existing repeat sequence. Using an RNA template within the enzyme telomerase elongate the parental strand in the 5' to 3' direction and add additional repeat as it moves down the parental strand. The legend strand is being completed by DNA polymerase alpha which carries a DNA primase as one of its subunits. In this way, the original information at the end of linear chromosome is completely copied in the new DNA.